The green energy revolution promised by nuclear fusion has moved a step closer thanks to the first successful use of a cutting-edge artificial intelligence system to shape superheated hydrogen plasmas inside a fusion reactor. The successful tests suggest that the application of AI might be a breakthrough in the long-term quest for nuclear fusion-generated electricity, putting it potentially near to replacing fossil fuels and nuclear fission in contemporary power grids. This will be a significant step forward. In order to find out more, let's jump right into the video. But first, we're going to give away $100 to one of our lucky subscribers. All you have to do is watch the entire video, leave a comment with your greatest takeaway, like, share, and lastly, subscribe. So, without further ado, let's get started. Alphabet's AI system has recently caught up on how to manage a magnetic field in a fusion reactor, and it might open the path to endless sustainable energy generation. The accomplishment, in which a DeepMind design system was able to manage the magnetic field in a Swiss tokamak reactor, might pave the door for new fusion reactor designs. The process, which generates massive amounts of energy, has been hailed as a potentially unlimited source of renewable energy. Nuclear fusion, which drives stars such as the Sun, provides clean, infinite energy by smashing and fusing hydrogen atoms into helium. In contrast to other energy sources, Fusion emits no greenhouse gases and only minor amounts of radioactive waste. However, at the lowest pressures attainable on Earth, the temperatures required to accomplish fusion must be extremely high, generally exceeding 100 million degrees Celsius. The tokamak, a donut-shaped vacuum ring by magnetic coils that can hold a plasma of hydrogen hotter than the sun's core, is one option. However, the plasmas in these devices are unstable making it difficult to continue the process necessary for nuclear fusion. A control system must coordinate the coils and change the voltage on them hundreds of times per second to guarantee that the plasma never reaches the walls of the tokamak, which would result in heat loss and perhaps damage. Tokamak reactors aspire to create fusion energy by trapping plasma in a magnetic field. However, managing the magnetic field is difficult. The reactors employ a powerful magnetic field to contain plasma at extremely high temperatures, hundreds of millions of degrees Celsius, far hotter than the sun's core, allowing nuclear fusion between hydrogen atoms to occur. Every nuclear reactor in operation today is a fission reactor, which uses the energy generated when heavy atoms like uranium disintegrate into smaller atoms, a process similar to that utilized in the early nuclear bombs. A fusion reactor operates in the reverse direction, harnessing the energy released when two smaller atoms come together, resulting in the production of tiny, fast-moving particles smaller than atoms. However, in order to do so, firms must discover a technique to extract energy from a plasma that is kept at millions of degrees Celsius, a task that has eluded academics for decades. Tokamaks create and sustain plasmas using a sequence of magnetic coils, the parameters of which, particularly the voltage, must be constantly monitored. DeepMind experts created and trained an AI system capable of creating and maintaining certain plasma configurations on the simulator at the Swiss Plasma Center at the École Polytechnique Fédérale de Lausanne. After being trained, the AI-based system was able to develop and maintain a broad range of plasma forms and complex configurations, including one in which two independent plasmas are kept in the vessel at the same time. The study team also put their novel system through its paces on the tokamak to determine how it would fare in real-world situations. Similar to the progress we've seen when applying AI to other scientific domains, our successful demonstration of tokamak control shows the power of AI to accelerate and assist fusion science. And we expect increasing sophistication in the use of AI going forward, the DeepMind team wrote in a blog post. This capacity to create controllers autonomously might be utilized to build new types of tokamaks while also designing their controllers. Our findings also indicate a promising future for reinforcement learning in complicated machine control. DeepMind was instantly intrigued in the potential of proving their AI technology in an area like nuclear fusion, and especially on a real-world system like a tokamak, said Federico Felici, an SBC scientist and paper co-author. All of the DeepMind experts with whom we collaborated were extremely eager and knowledgeable about using AI in control systems. Felici was fascinated by the incredible things DeepMind could perform in a short period of time when it concentrated its energies on a certain project. 
According to Felici, the tokamak is primarily controlled by 19 magnetic coils that may be used to shape and position the hydrogen plasma inside the fusion chamber while directing an electric current across it. The coils are often controlled by a collection of independent computerized controllers, one for each facet of the plasma included in an experiment, that are designed based on intricate control engineering calculations, depending on the specific conditions being examined. However, he claimed that the new AI system could manipulate the plasma with a single controller. DeepMind's AI, a deep reinforcement learning system, was originally trained on simulations of the tokamak, a far cheaper and safer alternative to the actual thing. However, computer simulations are slow. To mimic a few seconds of a real-time tokamak activity, it takes many hours. Furthermore, the experimental state of the TCV might change from day to day, Therefore, the AI developers are required to account for those changes in the simulations. However, once the simulated training process was completed, the AI was connected to the actual tokamak. The TCV can sustain a superheated hydrogen plasma for up to 3 seconds at temperatures of more than 216 million degrees Fahrenheit, that's 120 million degrees Celsius. After that, it takes 15 minutes to cool down and reset, and Felici estimates that between 30 and 35 such shots are performed each day. Over many days, he fired roughly 100 rounds with the TCV under the AI control. We wanted some type of variation in the different plasma forms we could obtain, and to try it under various settings. According to Felici, the AI showed effectiveness in positioning and shaping the plasma inside the Tokamax fusion chamber in the most frequent configurations, including the so-called snowflake form, which is regarded to be the most efficient fusion configuration. Furthermore, it was able to form the plasma into droplets, distinct upper and lower rings of plasma within the chamber, which had never been done before. Although traditional control engineering approaches may have worked as well, according to him. The droplet form was quite straightforward to do using machine learning, according to Felici. All we had to do was ask the controller to produce the plasma that way, and the AI found out how to accomplish it. The researchers also saw that AI was employing the magnetic coils to manage the plasmas within the container in a different way than the traditional control system would have, he added because they are obtaining much better models of how the tokamak works, and they can use these sorts of tools to more sophisticated challenges. Felici also stated that they may now try to apply the same notions to far more complicated situations. Elon Musk, Tesla's CEO and a millionaire, previously expressed his views on nuclear fusion, and the study has impressed him, except for one factor, the price. It's fascinating and it definitely can and should be done. He tweeted regarding fusion research, but I predict its best case will be more expensive than wind and solar, meaning enormous fusion reactors in the sky. Far more than a half century, fusion energy has been regarded as the holy grail of energy creation. While the physics and technology underlying reactor designs have advanced significantly, Musk is correct that it remains a distant dream. Other than that, nuclear fusion is one of the most promising sources of clean, sustainable energy. It's also extremely tough to achieve, which is why experts are also looking to artificial intelligence for assistance. While DeepMind's breakthrough is impressive, it is merely the first step in developing a viable source of fusion energy. According to the lab, modeling a tokamak takes many hours of computer time for one second of actual time. A tokamak state might alter from day to day, necessitating the development of algorithmic enhancements both physically and in modeling. Let us know what you think of the nuclear fusion breakthrough. If you like this video, check out these other videos.